Hello guys and welcome to another code optimization tutorial and today we're going to talk about unreachable code. I'm very sorry this is a little bit later than normally, it's uh, very busy in my life currently because due to some personal reasons, but let's just talk about optimization for now. Um, this is something a lot of people uh, think it is not optimization because if it's not, the code is not reachable, it will never get executed, so it will never, uh, well, affects the actual code. So it's something a lot of people think there isn't an optimization, a lot of people think there is an optimization in this. In the end, um, I can say there is an optimization in it and it's the if loop, um, the if statement itself. Um, because normally a reachable code uh, is due to a loop and the statement of it, that is the way you can make uh, an optimization because for example, if you need to check how long a list is, it can take some while, at least if the list is very long. Um, things like that, it can be a little bit uh, tricky to talk about this because, well, it is discussed. Um, but in the end, I think everyone can agree that having unreachable code is just stupid to have in your site your code, so you don't need to see this only as an optimization, but also to make your script uh, better to see what's happening within your script. Um, so this is unreachable code. If, uh, I'm very sorry length is spelled wrong, but whatever. If one equals two, or if a list length is less than zero, both things will never happen. Uh, so everything that's standing with do something will never get executed, so that's already something that's very annoying, but also every frame it runs this statement and thinks hmm do i need to do this or don't uh, or don't have i to do this so it will every frame it will redo that statement and every time of course there will be a false false value and this is something that makes it well a kind of stupid to have this inside your code of course you guys are not going to make those mistakes um, that's something that uh, is already uh, way too basic to actually do this. But there are some things uh, like you have a list and you have a length and there's always uh, one that's always the same. And you just say something like, if it's zero, then you do something. Well, it actually needs to be one. It's something that you need to think about and some people will use it, some uh, other not. But I still hope you guys learned something from it. And if you did, please leave a like or subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time with another uh, thing to optimize your scripts. And then it's going to be a little bit more about the optimization itself. Um, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.